Hello and welcome to yet another YouTube video here on this channel. This is again another different one and if you're new to the channel I talk about productivity, productivity apps, methods and mental health and I try to combine those things because I think that productivity is really important for mental health and in today's video I wanted to talk about one thing I have been struggling with all my life uh, and especially a little lately I have had my struggles with this problem and I've learned that if I have a problem there is probably someone out there that has the same problem and I have promised to always be as honest as I can about the things I am struggling with and lately that has been loneliness and I think we have a loneliness epidemic because I know that a lot of people are lonely out there and I think it has gotten worse ever since the pandemic and I was very very lonely when I was younger because I am a little weird I mean I make YouTube videos around notebooks and note-taking apps and note-taking methods so I have a few interests that are a little weird and I live in a small town uh, and it is so small that we don't even have a stationary store we have bookshops that sells pens but I actually have to order everything for my notebook even uh, ink for my fountain pens I have to order online uh, so there aren't a lot of people interested in the same thing as me and it has been like that as long as I can remember because I've always had really weird interests and one thing that has helped me a lot uh, in my youth and still maybe can help me was like small internet forums uh, or discord servers or just groups on Facebook that had the same interest as me and I could talk about all of the things I enjoyed because I try to do that with the people around me but I completely understand that after the fourth hour of me talking about new note-taking apps and the notebook I recently bought you can get a little tired so growing up a lot of uh, these internet forums were actually really important in my life and one of the reasons I actually started this YouTube channel I would never if you had told me that it would grow to over a thousand subscribers I would never believe you because I didn't think that there were so many people interested in the same thing as me and I also do not make the best videos yet but hopefully that will get better uh, but I wanted to start this channel because I was bored because I felt lonely because I didn't have anyone to discuss these nerdy things with uh, and I did that and it grew a lot faster than I would ever imagine this used to be a fashion channel because I'm really into fashion and suits as well I actually uh, co-founded a clothing brand so I am really into that as well but I started this channel mainly because I felt lonely. I turned it into a productivity channel because I felt lonely. So this isn't necessarily about how you can become more productive. My channel won't help you become more productive. I can give you a couple of tips around productivity and things that have worked for me, but it isn't necessarily about how becoming more productive. I would rather say that my YouTube channel is around uh, mental health and productivity as a hobby or as a tool to improve your mental health and in my eyes I think that productivity is just a way to have more time doing the things you want and to exercising uh, the ability of figuring out what you like doing and trying to do more of that. That is what my channel will mainly always be about. But I've also added a few more things to this. That's why I haven't filmed a video lately because I have been busy building out a Discord server which will start off small uh, but the goal of that Discord server is to give people the thing that 
internet forums gave me when I was a little younger to have a place where you can discuss all of the nerdy things and just get to know people that have the same interests as you and over time I'm hoping that it will grow uh, but as of right now it's just me and five bots and uh, it will probably be a few more people uh, in the future but as of right now it is just me it is small but I wanted to do it because the discord servers I have been in and the internet forums I've been in has meant so much for me growing up so uh, that has always been one of the goals when I first saw that this YouTube channel was growing uh, one of the goals was to help people feel less lonely and uh, the discord server will have my youtube videos on there uh, but apart from that i will not do any advertising or try to sell you anything through the discord channel it isn't a community necessarily around me and my youtube channel it is a community around the things we enjoy uh, which is planning and productivity and the I just wanted to try and make people feel a little less lonely and make myself feel a little less lonely uh, and I'm not going to say that on this YouTube channel or on social media in general I will never try to sell anything because I will but I can promise you that I will never try to sell anything through a community like that and the reason for me saying it is because there are a lot of communities built on built only to sell something that's not my goal here my goal is to make myself and others feel a little less lonely at times and having a place we can turn to to discuss all of the nerdy things we care about uh, that's probably going to be my main goal with this discord uh, channel and i will leave a link to it down below so if you want to you can join uh, as i said it will start small uh, but i'm hoping for it to grow and to really become a community of people that enjoy the same thing um, to sort of be a place that I had when I was a little younger. My passion will always be mental health and trying to feel and make people feel a little better because I have had so many struggles in my youth and I just wish that I had people around me or I had people around me but having people on the internet that didn't make it worse. Uh, that's what I am trying to do to help spread happiness and positivity through all of my channels whether that's from talking about different note-taking apps and discussing them or it is about making a video like this to tell you and be honest about the fact that I am lonely and I have per periods in my life right like right now where I feel lonely and just to be honest and say that I am struggling because social media internet is fake everyone has negative experiences from time to time and I have promised to be honest about them uh, not complain but be honest that things are a little hard and I'm working through them and I will always be able to work through them because I have a toolkit of things I can do whenever I feel down um, so whether it is that or it is something else I will always try to try to spread happiness and positivity and when I say that my dream is to become a full-time content creator that is mainly because I want to figure out a way to be able to help people that might have had the same problems as me I want to be the person I didn't have on the internet when I was younger that's the main goal that's what I am working towards um, hopefully i will be able to but i just wanted to make a video talking about the fact that 
I am struggling and I am trying to start this Discord server to both help myself and help others. And just to tell you that it is okay to feel a little lonely and it doesn't necessarily need to be bad. I've had a lot of great things happen to me because I was lonely. I started this YouTube channel which grew because I was lonely. I grew my uh, TikTok following to 35,000 followers because I was lonely. So it isn't necessarily just bad, but it is okay to feel the way I feel right now and the way you might feel right now. It is okay to have emotions. It doesn't make you weak. It only makes you human. We can't go around and be happy all of the time. We will have negative experiences and we will be able to work through them. So just let me end this sort of weird video uh, out with saying that whatever you're going through, it will be okay. You are incredibly strong and you will get through everything life throws at you. And with, with each obstacle, you will find new tools, better ways to manage emotions and become even stronger. So just keep going, keep believing in yourself and remember that it is okay to feel sad depressed or whatever you're feeling right now but it doesn't need to be the end of the world you will get through it and just don't give up everything will be okay thank you so so much for watching today's youtube video